Okay, hey guys, John of Fix a Fence here. Uh, five, oh, anyway, uh, <clears throat> we're here in Portland, Oregon, putting up a, a chain link uh, single swing gate. And I don't know if you remember in a couple of the other videos, I've shown you uh, the bulldog hinge, okay? And uh, these are kind of special units, and then they're kind of cool, you know, a bulldog hinge. I don't know if you've ever seen those or not. Maybe you can see my face through that hole there, but that's kind of cool. Hey, I can see it. Uh, but anyway, yeah. We got a bunch of four. We got a four-inch post uh, installed here. Okay, Tanner's putting the putting the thing on there, putting the bulldog hinge on there. Now, uh, okay, now I got to instruct Tanner what to do. So uh, you're going to have to take that U-bolt off and go below the tension band, Tanner, because that yeah, the, the gate's only 42 inches high. So we need to get that as low as possible. Okay. And then this one on top. Goes. Just hold on. Okay. So uh, once we get these uh, things uh, in place, I'll show you what's going on. Um, so uh, anyway, hey, hang in there. Here we go. We're going to start putting this bulldog hinge on. We've already got the bottom. Follow my finger, Tanner. Mm -hmm. We've already got the bottom one on. Okay. Now what we're going to do here is we got to remember those ball hinges here. So that's going to go in there like that. Okay. Now you got the bulldog hinges. Okay. What we do is we take the collar off, okay? Take the nuts and bolts off, take the collar off like that, put it up in here like that. Reason being is because you don't want people taking the gate off. You don't want people taking the gate off, okay? Uh, it's all about security, okay? So then you put these nuts and bolts back in. Anyway, so, yeah. Get the nuts and bolts back in, and once you get the nuts and bolts back in, then you can tighten them up. Okay, if my hands would work for me. I like that. Tanner's getting a nice close-up shot for you guys. Okay, so we're going to tighten them up, and then we'll put it up on there. And uh, and as soon as we get it, because we're going to take four hands here, uh, Tanner and me to get this. So uh, you guys get the idea what you got to do. You get this on here, put this on here. Once that doesn't uh, have any play in there, because I can't take it off now. So we're going to take this and put this up there onto that ball. Then we're going to suck it up and put that u-bolt in there all right and and we will get to that right now so anyway yeah we got the gate up there nice and hung and uh tighten tanner's tightening up the uh the collar bolts right now and uh so yeah that's about it we uh when I showed you how to put a single swing gate on, probably about a 15 footer. Uh, oh, maybe more like a 12 footer. But anyway, it's a pretty long gate here. It's hanging off of a four inch post and, and we put a lot of concrete in there. I mean, my goodness, look at that set. That's oh, yeah. huge, you know. Three feet deep too. Three feet deep. You know, it ain't going nowhere. So uh, anyway, yeah, uh, John at Fix a Fence. Uh, again, just showing you guys uh, how to put a, a a couple of bulldog hinges on for a single swing gate those large ones you know that's pretty important really you don't want to use those little pin hinges you know uh post hinges on this top of a gate it's too heavy it'll probably break them you know because it gets a lot of abuse you don't want to open it up a lot of times so but anyway all right john fix a fence many broken fences you guys have a great day